We meet together on the traditional lands of the Wurundjeri Woi Wurrung people and I pay my respects to all ancestors, elders, communities and Ngakwaran, families from here, families from all across this great nation and neighbouring islands. Joining us today is the Koori Youth, Will Shakespeare's, and also Kiernan, um, our didgeridoo player from Daralug. And to each and every one of you, can I pay your respects to your belonging, to your family, to your, your community. We celebrate NAIDOC week. NAIDOC is a time of coming together for our community and joining with you for the many achievements since the beginning of colonisation. There have been many and the Hawthorne Football Club has stood beside us each and every way. Can I tell you that it's a great privilege to stand here with the beautiful Tom Day artwork that is a reflection of reconciliation and what it means. Also today is such a time to pay respects to those who have walked this long journey before us and also those who have passed, not necessarily where they should be. And it is with the responsibility of the balm bearing, the smoking cleansing ceremony, where we hope that we will join the spirits of those to their rightful resting place. It's also about you taking care of yourself so that we can each take care of country for today and for tomorrow. We also have a welcoming ceremony following the balm bearing and the Wurundjeri known as the Managum people. It's about sharing the gift of this branch. I take a leaf on your behalf Accepting this, and I hope that you do, we say Najkunwa, thank you, because it means you've joined with us to honour the spirits of our ancestors who have nurtured this very ground where the hawks and crows will play today. We also say that the journey has been long for our communities, but we're strong and we'll stand by you if you walk with us. This year's theme of NAIDOC is get up, stand up, show up. And in our Woi Wurrung language, Wawinjaka, Wurundjeri Balak, Yemen, Kundi Bik, you are most welcome to the traditional lands of the Wurundjeri Woi Wurrung people. Nodjikanwa.
are too deadly. Thank you so much to Arnie Joy Murphy and the Koori Youth Group. We're finally kicking off our NADOC match today. I'm thrilled to welcome you all here today. My name is Talia Little. I'm a proud Arunda Luritja woman from Central Australia. Always thanking the Wurundjeri mob for letting me live and work here. You mob are deadly. We love you so much. So this week is NADOC week. It's honestly my favourite week of the year and I know all these mobs too. This week celebrates the history, culture and achievements of all First Nations people and participate in celebration of the oldest continuing living culture on this earth. To join us in a sign of unity, I would like to kindly ask everyone to stand up out of your seats and turn your torchlight on. The 2022 NADOC theme is get up, stand up and show up. This is what we as First Nations people do every single day for our communities. And this year is a call to action for all of you to be active allies and show the importance of celebrating our culture and standing up for change. You will see today here on the stadium roof the Tarakook from our reconciliation plan artwork. It represents the journey we are on as a club and our continued goal to reconciliation through gaining knowledge and wisdom from our people. After the game, we will often sit down together and pick apart the game, win, lose or draw. After a game, I'll often go home and see my kids and give them a great big cuddle. After a game, I'll often stretch and jump straight in the ice bath. After the game, I'll often receive racially vilifying comments on all my social media platforms. It's simply not okay. Our First Nations community deserve better. We deserve better. We must seek to continue to educate ourselves and learn more about our First Nations people. Because we're better than that. If you're a fan of the Hawthorne Football Club or not, we play for you because you love the game. So you have to take a stand as well, because what we need are allies in this fight. When you see it, call it out. That means more than you will know. We need your support. This is a challenge to everyone. When you see these comments, call them out. Make a stand. It's time for a change. It isn't good enough that this still happens. It doesn't matter if it is someone behind a fake account. So when you see it, call it out. Here at Hawthorne Football Club, we strive to be a part of change and help celebrate our First Nations people and the impact they have in our communities. I now ask that we all take a moment to reflect on the role you guys can play. How will you, as active allies, get up, stand up and show up? 